So our analysis this year of this year's data really revealed six key themes, which are shown here, uh, along with the percentage of participating companies that mentioned them uh, at least once in their responses. Topping the list are issues related to town management, uh, which every company that uh, we surveyed uh, mentioned uh, to some degree. And you know, given the great resignation, as well as the labor shortages that we saw uh, over the past year, this certainly isn't surprising that this shows up as a really salient theme. Uh, right below this, we see the related theme of leadership development and succession planning. So companies are focused not on not only on talent broadly, but really seem to be focusing particular attention on developing their pool of next generation leaders. And as we go through the results today, I'll uh, share some thoughts on why that might be. A little more than half of the companies also highlighted issues related to the hybrid environment as key heading into this year. In particular, companies adopting hybrid work arrangements uh, are focused on issues uh, dealing with cultural transformation as well as uh, work design. Last year, uh, employee well being was a prevalent theme, not surprising given the kind of burnout and stress uh, that we saw across the workforce. And it shows up again this year. But interestingly, it seems to be embedded in this kind of broader theme around employee expectations, employee experience. And as I mentioned previously, some of the uh, heightened sense of employee activism that we're seeing in uh, today's environment. The final two themes, uh, DEI and COVID, were interestingly uh, the most prominent themes in last year's survey. So, you know, one might ask the question, you know, why are they kind of uh, lower ranked this year? And I don't believe that their lower ranking necessarily means that they uh, are of lesser importance or that companies are focusing less attention on these issues, uh, but rather it's probably more an indication that these issues have really become firmly embedded in the HR agenda of most, if not uh, all organizations. So, uh, you know, kind of taking these as table stakes and then, you know, as companies were responding, we're highlighting other issues that are maybe emerging on their HR uh, agendas. So let's, uh, let's uh, take a moment to delve into uh, each of these themes to kind of better understand them and some of the specific issues uh, that companies mentioned around each of them. 